see the 2019 uh, Andhra Pradesh picture, remember the YSRCP did very well in the Lok Sabha elections uh, which were held at that time. So the YSRCP had 22 seats, the TDP 3, the BJP didn't open its account. The YSRCP had 50% of the votes, the TDP 40%, the BJP won. Of course, the BJP thinks that from 2019 to now, they've been able to improve their vote share somewhat in Andhra Pradesh. Now, if I come back to, you know, doing the same calculations that we did in uh, Andhra Pradesh, uh, uh, that we did in Karnataka here in Andhra Pradesh, and remember, it's not so simplistic. The reason I'm doing it is because it gives you a broad sense of uh, how things are. But an assembly election is very different from a Lok Sabha election. But out of the 25 seats of Andhra Pradesh, the YSRCP won 22, the TDP 3, the YSRCP was runner-up on 3, uh, the TDP was runner-up on 22, the BJP wasn't even runner-up on a single seat. Uh, so this is the situation in Andhra Pradesh. I want to go across to King Shuk now on the impact that a possible BJP TDP alliance in Andhra Pradesh could possibly have. Uh, do you want to give us a sense, uh, King Shuk Nag, in your estimate, how much of an impact could this have? How could this change dynamics for the next Lok Sabha elections and state elections will be, which will be held at that time? Most keen about this tie up is the TDP. TDP okay. is most keen to tie up with the BJP and nobody else. And they're very keen because they think they'll be the front runner and they will tie up with the BJP. But if I, you ask me, I, my understanding is that the BJP is not interested in tying up with Naidu. Because I think Mr. Modi wants to tie up with Jagan. And Mr. Modi almost treats Jagan like his son. But why would, why would Jagan want to tie up with the, the BJP? Jagan already won 22 out of 25. He has a vote share of 50. Why would he need the BJP? There are a lot of cases against him. He needs the support of the big brother in Delhi, therefore. And his uncle was murdered and there's a case going on and two of his, one of his MPs is also in jail. And tomorrow he can also be named. So there's a lot of infighting and all. But on top of it, Jagan is being supported by the Prime Minister and a, the, their relation is like a father and son, let me tell you. Okay, you're saying they have a father-son relationship. Sandeep Shastri, your sense of Andhra Pradesh and the prospects of the TDP-BJP allying because there have been multiple indications of late. You know, not just did uh, Chandrababu Naidu meet uh, Home Minister Amit Shah on Saturday, the 3rd of June. There have been multiple statements from both sides suggesting that, you know, something seems to be cooking. You're asking me? Sandeep Shastri, okay. you're on mute, sir. Uh, I believe that the chances of a TDP-BJP alliance are much stronger than the chances of a YSR-BJP alliance. Remember in the 2014 elections, uh, the slogan that uh, Chandrababu Naidu used was, yes, Namo in Andhra also, but Namo is Narendra, not Narendra Modi, but Naidu Modi. So I think uh, the chances of the alliance between the two is much stronger because I think there is mutual benefit with such an alliance. Chandrababu Naidu would uh, stake his claim to do well in the state assembly elections. The BJP will demand a big pound of electoral flesh in the assembly elections also. It will not be that uh, Naidu will have a smooth sailing, get a majority on his own. So I think the BJP will bargain hard and the TDP will have limited choices of accepting what is offered to them because that's the only way they can actually challenge YSR Congress. Yashwan and Deshmukh, I, what's I your data telling you uh, if the BJP TDP were to ally, how much of a threat would that pose to the YSR CP dominance in Andhra Pradesh? Yashwan? Give me a moment as I try and set that connection with Yashwan Deshmukh, right? But let me put that same question in the meanwhile to Ramkrishna Upadhyay and get his sense of the prospects of a BJP TDP alliance and the impact this may have in Andhra Pradesh. I think Rahul, uh, that prospect is much uh, better, or uh, I know, than uh, the one in Karnataka. 
know, BJP JDS alliance is not going to work in Karnataka, but TDP and BJP is very much, I think, a possibility because the BJP also needs, uh, you know, some stronger party to support. They have tried in the last uh, two or three elections, but they have not been successful. So, but uh, since uh, there is going to be assembly elections also coming up, I think they would go with the TDP uh, because that will give them a leg up, uh, you know, in the uh, both the elections. So they will be able to take on Jagan, and uh, that is a possibility. But uh, uh, we'll have to see how much of uh, you know ground the Naidu will be ready to give to the BJP because BJP will not accept a, you know second fiddle. Uh, uh, in a position in that uh, state. So it has to be worked out and if they are able to work it out, I think it will be to mutual advantage.